The St. Lucia Sports Academy this week erected a large, colorful billboard honoring Naya Jules, who has made a name for herself in the sports of javelin and pole vault locally and regionally, and Theo Edward, who has made his homeland proud in cricket locally and on the regional scene. Principal Delia Charles of the St. Lucia Sports Academy says, the achievements of the academy students are not only a testament to the institution, but also to the nation. According to Charles, the purpose of recognizing these students in such a manner is to offer them motivation to remain steadfast in pursuit of their aspirations and to elevate their accomplishments, thereby instilling greater pride in their families and the entire country. We are working with our students and taking them to greatness with the right resources and facilities, we believe our students can perform even better. To Naya and Theo, your commitment, your skills, determination, discipline, and passion for your sports have brought you to this level in your sporting career and contributed to your success. The Ministry of Youth and Sports has applauded the initiative which celebrates the successes of students even before they get out of the school system. Acting Director of Sports, Clivus Jules, extended encouragement to the many students in attendance to work hard to ensure they too end up on a billboard in their honor. I know you have it within you. You have the staff here to make it happen for you, provide that kind of support for you. So of course, please work towards that. That being said, on behalf of the Ministry of Youth Development and Sports, I want to congratulate Theo Edward and Naya Jules on their performances in recent times. I want to encourage them to continue to do well. Theo Edward in 2022 campaigned the St. Lucia team for the Windward's Winlot Games, scoring back-to-back -back centuries in all four matches in the tournament. He is currently captain of both the St. Lucia and Windward Islands under-15 team, and vice captain for the Windward's under-17 team. Naya Jules, on the other hand, currently holds the record for women's pole vault and gold medalist for the 2023 Carifta Games. She is also the bronze medalist of the 2023 Carifta Women's Javelin Tournament and is the current gold medalist for Javelin in the Windward Islands Winlock Games. My aspiration for the next few years is to get into the West Indies Academy and hopefully play the Under-19 World Cup for West Indies. Every game I play, Coach Gary tells me, um, you fail to prepare, prepare to fail. Today is a celebration of hard work, dedication, and I, will, and I would like to leave you with these words. Hard work beats talent. When talent does not work hard, keep working, keep pushing, I thank you. The St. Lucia Sports Academy intends to replicate the event to fill the designated area with many more billboards honoring the outstanding achievements of its students for years to come. From the Communications Unit of the Department of Education, Innovation and Vocational Training, I am Chris Satney, reporting.